Hey bros, what's that? I am the Shredder, and I am here to destroy you for the rest of your knife. I am a cut above the rest. I am here to razor the roof. Do you like to read Fifty Shades of Blades? Alright, we get it. You can can it now on the puns. Get it? Cannon, because you're a giant can opener. Ah, uh, Mikey. Go to BigBadToyStore.com to get your Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle movie figures and go Ninja, go Ninja, go. Link in the description. Oh, Big kids, here's your big review of the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles 2014 movie, The Shredder Basic Action Figure. I want to thank Playmates Toys for sending out this review for you guys. Make sure to like their Facebook page and check out their website. Link is in the description. It says Ninja Turtles, not Teenage Mutant, even though uh, that's the full title. We got the four turtles right here, and we got uh, Shredder looking all mechanical eyes. Uh, as well as so the Shredder. Back here has that same bio that we've been getting with all the other figures. Everyone fears the Shredder! And uh, we got all eight of the basic uh, action figures. Well, it's time to shred into this figure. We got the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles 2014 movie Shredder. A very badass and interesting update to a classic villain. Let's take a closer look at him. Now, Shredder has a very interesting, almost robotic look in the movie. In fact, they refer to him as a robot samurai. So we don't know if he's a robot or if he's the Eric Sachs character, or he really is Rukusaki in underneath there, we'll find out in the movie, but please don't spoil it if you've seen the movie already. His head sculpt almost has like a very skeleton-like look to it. His The sculpting on the mask is pretty good. The eyes look a little weird. It just looks like drilled holes. The helmet looks pretty cool though. I, I do like it, just there is supposed to be a human under there, I guess, but I don't know if it is a robot or a human, but um, I do like the silver paint on here. Uh, the sculpting is pretty good and I do like his armor it does have this really cool look to it. it has the pointy shoulder pads and he has all these knives uh, coming out of him as you can see in the trailers and will appear to be in the movie but he does have some human looking skin under there so it does look like it's a human under there but yeah I, he does have this really cool cape that has some very cool detailing and it even has knives along it and it is removable you can take this cape off and see the underneath there it has some tabs right there and shredder boat but yeah like you can see that he has a very robotic s look to it almost like the silver samurai and the wolverine movie uh so i don't know how to feel about that yet i'll see the movie but it totally does look pretty cool i have to admit and i do i am liking the look minus the weird eyes articulation shredder's head can uh, fully rotate uh it can't really go up and down sadly the shoulder pads do go up so that you can fully rotate the arms and go in and out. He does bend at the elbow, which the armor is connected right there, so it has it moves along with the arm, which is cool. It rotates at the wrist, which is great, and he does have full waist articulation. The legs do go forward and back. They do go in and out, but you have to move them this way, and because there's no upper leg rotation, his legs will be that way, so that's what's sad. But it does bend at the knee, not a full 90 degree, though. And he does have ankle uh, articulation for him back no ankle pivot but it does help uh, with posing it is past your shred time you can see i'm a sharp dressed man i keep in shape by doing six minute stabs hey we get the point you will get the point uh. size comparison time so here you can see the shredder is taller than the other movie figures like april neil or Raphael. he's about the same size as his nickelodeon uh, counterpart and you can see he is actually as big as a six inch figure like the Marvel Legends Amazing Spider-Man 2 Spider-Man. Now even though they made the Shredder very mechanical eyes, like very Silver Samurai, the Wolverine uh, S in the movie, I really liking the look of him. And I think the figure looks pretty cool minus his weird eyes. But yeah, I like that he has some pretty good articulation and pretty good paint apps for the most part. I'm really liking the design and the figure in itself even though he doesn't have any real accessories but the size and the articulation do make up for it. I think if you have the four turtles and you're going to get at least one more figure this is definitely the one to have. You definitely got to have your shredder uh, for your turtles to face off. I want to thank Playmates Toys for sending out this to review. Make sure to like their Facebook page. You can get this at BigBadToyStore.com. Link is in the description. Check out more at my website SeanXLong.com and ToyNewsEye.com. Uh, remember to like me on Facebook, follow me on Twitter and Instagram. Link is in the description. I'm Sean Long. Remember to live long and love life. Everything's better when you're the Shredder. Hey, Silver Samurai, prepare to meet your match, bub. Wait, I'm not Silver Samurai. It doesn't matter, bub. I'm the best at what I do, and what I do is open up tin cans. No! I am a Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle. I
strike hard, and I fade away into the night. You're the whole power! Michelle, are you guys? Are you in the future? Are you red? E? Ha 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 ha.